Hello everyone, welcome back. Today's topics will be sorting and subtotaling. So we'll get right into it. The first thing we want to do is show sorting. Now notice that my report here is sorted by person in alphabetical order. But maybe I want to change it in uh, reverse alphabetical order. I can do that. If I come up to the header person, I can right click and go sort descending. And notice that the order has now changed. Additionally, I can use the down arrow that's to the right of the title and go and sort descending. So it's now back to the original sort. Now I can also sort from a metric perspective. So if I pull down the arrow, I can sort descending or ascending. In this particular case, I'm going to go ahead and sort descending so that my values are greatest to least. Um, so technology for Chuck McGee happens to be my number one sales and my furniture for Cassandra is my least. But notice that when you do that, Chuck is now in two different places uh, in the sort order. What I would prefer to see is my salespeople and then sorted uh, after my salespeople are sorted, I want to sort by their best and worst categories. So to do that, I'm going to go ahead and go and do an undo to get away from my sales sorting. So now I'm back to the original um, report. So I'm sorted by person and then my sales are randomly and category are random within that. So the next thing I want to do is I want to do what's called an advanced sort. So I'm going to go ahead, left the down arrow using my left mouse button, and go to Advanced Sort. Now notice that person was already a, was already sorted on because uh, we had done that earlier, but I'm going to change this to descending order. So then now that uh, it won't be in alphabetical, it'll be in reverse alphabetical. And then the second thing I want to sort on is the amounts. So I want to sort on sales, and again I want to do this in descending order. Now what this will show me is my salespeople and then which categories by the sales numbers are rank ordered by best to worst. So in everyone except for Ann, technology is first. Notice that Ann furniture is the best. So that was your sorting, advanced sorting and regular sorting. So now I want to add subtotaling. And if you notice that subtotaling or totaling is not turned on here, to do that, you have to turn it on in two locations. The first place is in the panel. So you left click on the ellipsis, left mouse click on the ellipsis, and you go to show totals. <clears throat> Notice that totals are turned on, and uh, all the subtotals for the category for all of the attributes showed up. So the first thing I want to do is um, I want to turn off one of the subtotals. So to do that, you can do one of two things. You can actually go into the header of any of the subtotals in the column that you're looking at. If you right click, you can go and click on remove. And notice that that subtotal was turned off. Now if you want to turn it back on, you can do, um, you obviously can't do it here because there's no subtotal. So go up to the header and you can either right click in the header and go to show totals and turn it on here. Or you could use the down arrow and left mouse button and click on show totals and you could have turned it on or off there. I want you to notice that while we're here that there are other totals you can actually shoot, show as well. That would be average, min, max, count, and so forth. You can have them on all at the same time as well. But for the sake of brevity, we'll just keep it with totals. One of the things that my accountants like to do is like they like to see their totals at the top. And we can do that very quickly. So again, going into the title of the total, and that's kind of a tongue twister. If you right click and go move to top, it moves those subtitle, uh, those totals and subtotals to the top of the sections. So, and, it, and that will work no matter where you uh, right click in the titles. Um, and if, so if I right click and in this total, I can move it to bottom. So now all of my totals are now at the bottom of their sections appropriate sections. One of the other things that you can do, some of the other things you can do, is you can reformat the total. So if I want to right click on the title, 
I can right click on the title and go format. Notice that the um, fast format bar shows up as well as my formatting uh, panel in my center panel here showed up and formatting of subtotals is done here at the bottom. For uh, just to show you what we can do, um, I'm going to go ahead and change the color of my title and change it to red. If you click anywhere outside that bar, uh, it will close. Now notice that the word title is now highlighted in red. I can do the same thing to the values. I can right click and go format. And I'm going to change this to red as well. And click outside of the area. So now I've got formatted totals and I can change those. I can make them bold or italics, whatever I'd like. So one of the other things that I can do is pull on another attribute uh, onto this report. So I'm going to pull subcategory onto the report to the right of category. And we're going to see what happens. Now notice when I pulled subcategory on, none of the subtotals for categories showed up. That's because I need to turn them on. To turn them on again, I can right click on the header or use the down arrow with my left mouse button and go show subtotals. And I'll turn those on and click on OK. Notice that they kept the formatting of all of the other subtotals that we were using the red. So quickly I'm going to go ahead and pull subcategory off of the report. Left click and drag, pull subtotals, uh, I'm sorry, subcategory off of the, the report. And then I'm going to pull it back on and show you what happens. Because we had turned subtotaling on onto that attribute, they remain, it remains on. So in this particular report, uh, once you've turned on the subtotaling, it will stay on and when you pull it on, it will, it will appear in the report itself. Hopefully you found this useful and uh, the, some of those small idiosyncrasies are now no longer hidden from you.